Hey everyone and welcome to the club. Today I'll be showing you how to draw Jackson Storm from Cars 3. We're going to be drawing the character facing over towards the left, so let's get started by drawing the top edge of the body. So we start in the middle of our page with a point. From this point I want to curve up over the wheel well and come down along the side of the body. So going up with a curve, rounding this out and then just pulling that down. Now I just want to dip down and then go back up over the back wheel and then back down again. So we're going to round this out going down, going up. Now we're just going to pull this down slightly towards the back of the car. Now from here I just want to draw the lower edge of the window. So just below the top of that curve, I'm going to draw a curve going across towards the left. So starting over on the left side, we'll go up slightly in the middle and then down behind that curve. Now on the left side, I just want to draw on the back side of the frame. So from this point, I'm going to step over and draw that same curve that I have on the right side, just curving up and then down. Now I'm going to connect these two points with a curve for the front edge of the bumper. Starting on the left, we'll curve down in the middle and pull it up on the right side. Now from these corners, I just want to curve down and back towards the bottom of the car. Starting on the left, we're going to curve this down and back over towards the right. We're going to take that same curve and draw it from this point here, curving back. Now we're going to take these two points and connect it with another curve, going down in the middle, over towards the right side. Now I just want to overlap this line, so I'm just going to go past this just a little bit, over towards the front tire. Let's move to the side of the car and draw on the front tire here. So I'm going to start with the wheel well first. So from here, I'm just going to curve up and just round it up towards the top. Now I want to tuck the tire in behind the wheel well. So we're going to draw a circle tucked in behind here. You're going to step down and just draw a circle. Going around and then just underneath the front of the car. I'm going to draw a smaller circle on the inside. So stepping in, just so want to draw an even frame all the way around. Now in the center here, we're going to draw a smaller circle for the center of the hubcap. Now we're going to take this curve and just continue this behind the tires, so just pulling it down. We're going to fill the inside edge in black. Let's add a little bit of detail to the hubcap. So from the top of the circle, I'm just going to curve up and over towards the right. At the bottom of the circle, I'm going to curve over towards the left. Curving down over towards the left. On the right side, we're going to curve down. And then on the left side, we're going to just curve this up and just tuck this in underneath. I'm just going to thicken this up on the inside. I'm going to take this point and just curve it a little bit further outwards. Do the same thing with the bottom, curving out. On the right side, we'll curve down. And then on the inside, we'll just curve it up. We're going to surround the outside of this hubcap with another circle. So starting at the top, this is just to add a little bit of trim. Just go all the way around and then tuck that in underneath. Let's continue working towards the back of the car. So just at the bottom here, I'm going to draw a curve. So I'm going to cross like this. Now I'm going to draw an oval in the back for the tire. So I'm going to start here. I'm going to go up towards the top and then just pull this down and then just pull this back up towards that starting point. At the bottom, I'm just going to draw a straight line going across for the bottom of the tire. And then from here, I'm just going to curve this up underneath the body. On the right of this tire, I'm just going to draw the edge of the wheel well. So starting up here, we're going to curve around the tire and just pull this back down to right about here. From the top, I'm just going to curve it out just around the tire down to right about here, a little bit higher than this bottom point. We're going to connect those two points with a curve, another hard turn coming in. The bottom here is going to go straight behind the tire. We're going to fill all this in black. Now let's add some detail to the tire. We're going to start by drawing a smaller oval on the inside. On the right side, we just want to draw a little bit of an edge just to show that the tire has got some depth to it. So starting at the top, we're just going to curve around towards the bottom. Now I'm going to surround this oval just on the outside, just for a little bit of tire trim. Let's go up to the top and draw on the top of the car. So we're going to start with the front edge of the windshield first. So from this point, we're just going to step over a little and curve over towards the right. Steep curve going back. Now from here, I'm going to curve around and then back in behind the top of the car. Starting up here, we're going to go across. 
and then just curve it down. Let's draw on the frame of the windshield. So from this corner, we're going to step down and draw a curve going back. To right about there. Now we're going to angle down with a straight line coming back. We're going to draw that twice. So we're going to step over, draw another angle line. Now we're going to take this point and just follow that curve all the way back towards the bottom. Now that we've got the main part of the body, let's go ahead and draw in the spoiler in the back. So we start at the back of the car here, draw an angled line going out. From here, I'm just gonna draw a short angled line going up, and then we'll pull this down towards the bottom line. Now I'm gonna take this line, just duplicate it right above. So stepping up, drawing a line in behind this little triangle. Then we're gonna draw little two lines down here, one line coming in an angle, stepping over and draw another one. Let's go back to the windshield and draw the eyes. So right in the middle here, I'm gonna draw a little point. From this point, I wanna curve up and out towards the left. I'm gonna curve up and out towards the right. We're gonna tuck the eyes in underneath this little eyelid. So right here, we're gonna draw a little half circle. Starting from the middle, curving down, and then tucking that in. We'll draw the next one right in the middle here. Going around and then back up. On the left side of the eyes, we're going to draw a small little circle for a highlight. And then in the middle of the eyes, we're going to draw a small circle for the pupil. So tucked in underneath the highlight, go around, we'll color that in black. We'll do the same thing on the right side. So underneath the highlight, circle around, and then we'll color that in black. Now let's go in and start adding some detail. So I'm going to start with the headlights first. So on the left side here, I'm just going to draw a short angle line coming down. Now we're gonna curve down towards this front edge of the bumper. Coming down, we're gonna curve, following this curve here, along the bottom, the short curve like that. Now we're gonna angle in and down towards the side of the car. We're gonna do the same thing over here. We're gonna start at the top, so lining this up, draw almost like a straight line going across. We're gonna curve down. Now we're gonna follow that same curve coming along the bottom, to right about there. Now we're gonna angle with a straight line coming down. We're going to add a little trim on the inside edge. So following these curves all the way on the inside. We're going to do the same thing on the right, starting at the top. Now we're going to draw on the edge of the hood. So this little line here that we just overlapped, we're going to continue this down the side out towards the left. We're going to come down towards the center, leaving a little gap. So we're going to curve down towards the middle. We're going to curve up towards the right. Up to right about there. Now we're going to take this point and curve over towards the bottom edge of the windshield. Up and over. Down here we're going to add in the mouth. So we're going to start on the left side. We're going to curve slightly upwards towards the right. We'll take that same starting point, curve down, and then back up towards the right side. Now we're going to add the teeth line, so from that same starting point, we're just going to cut this in half. Just going straight across the middle, over towards the right side. Let's add a little pink detail at the front here. So right at the top, we're going to curve down. So tapering this down towards this point, we're going to curve this down the side towards the bottom. Let's draw that big S on the side here. So we start at the bottom here, stepping up, drawing a curve, just following that same curve along the bottom. And we're going to curve up, just alongside the tire up, go straight across, now we're going to curve over the tire well, going up towards the back of the car. Now we're going to work our way backwards, we're going to step up, curving across, we go straight down, go straight across, towards the right, now we're going to taper this down towards the inside, going across like that, and that's pretty much it. There we have it, there's Jackson Storm from Cars 3. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send us your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.